Hello everyone, welcome back. We're out in the pepper patch here next to the garage and today's video is about the Zulu pepper which is a really cool, um, unusual looking pepper. Um, there's the tag for it there. These are planted with a whole bunch of other varieties but here's the Zulu pepper. It's a dark black pepper um, and it's kind of neat because <laughs> this is how I harvest them just with scissors that way you don't hurt the plant at all so I'm going to snip a few. It's a neat pepper because it's fairly high yielding. I only have a couple of plants, just I grew them as an experiment. Um, but they're just so cool looking and unusual and they don't seem to turn color like a lot of peppers. I mean, it's possible that they turn red eventually, but I don't think ours ever did. They stayed this color um, throughout the entire growing season. They started green, like more greenish and then turned purple rather than turning red like a lot of peppers. So it may be that they would turn red eventually, I don't know. Um, but here they are. We're going to take them inside, take a look at them, and um, talk a little bit more about their qualities. So here they are on the white cutting board. Their color really pops here uh, against the white background. So the Zulu pepper, it's just a bell pepper, you know, and I don't mean just like in a bad way or anything, but it, it, there's nothing about it that's really, that I've been able to detect that's different from just a green pepper in terms of flavor. The color is obviously the selling point on these. It's really cool. I mean, if you're looking for, you know, where you'd want that in terms of presentation, um, that can really add some pizzazz to your dishes, um, depending on what you're cooking. But, you know, the flavor, it's crispy green pepper flavor. It's, you know, unremarkable in terms of flavor. It's really the color, I think. And, you know, that's kind of true with a lot of bell peppers. If you think about it, they taste pretty much the same. They, want, they might be slightly more sweet. Um, slightly less sweet, but at the end of the day, they're bell peppers. It's about the color and, and you know, a little bit of crisp pepper flavor that they give you. Um, these don't really have much sweetness at all. As I mentioned, they're like a green pepper. As you can see, the, they're a little thin on the walls. I mentioned in the King of the North video, I prefer when bell peppers have really thick walls. I just like the texture better. Um, but these aren't bad. I mean, they're certainly fine to cook with. They're like a poblano in terms of the thickness of the the wall of the pepper itself so they hold up just fine um, but you know if you're gonna stuff them they're probably not the best stuffing pepper or anything like that you probably want to cook with them uh, some of them are a little thicker than others maybe they're just more developed that could be too so the Zulu pepper I probably you know would only grow it if I were looking for it for the ornamental aspect meaning I want a pepper that's specifically black or purple in terms of flavor it's it's fine but it's really not anything different than any other um, green pepper you might grow so thank you for watching, and we hope to see you again soon.